Patriot Prime Reviews is a channel for adult collectors and may not be suitable for children under 13 years of age. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey, what's going on guys? Patriot Prime here once again with another ToyHacks.com sponsored review. But before I get started, I need you guys to do me a favor. If you're watching this video right here and are not a subscriber of Patriot Prime Reviews, please consider hitting that subscribe button right now. It won't cost you a thing, but will help me and my channel out tremendously and help me reach my goal of 10,000 subscribers by TFCon in October. Now, on to the decals. And the set we're looking at in this video is for Transformers Generation Selects Shattered Glass, Optimus Prime, and Ratchet. This decal set includes five decal sheets, a combination of vinyl, foil, and clear-backed decals. Now I'm going to break up this decal video in two separate parts. One video for Optimus Prime and one video for Ratchet. So now let's take a look at Optimus Prime both before and after Toy Hacks decals. And welcome to Patriot Prime Reviews. <laughs> In robot mode, straight out of the packaging, Shattered Glass Optimus Prime looks amazing. I absolutely love the collar scheme on this figure. Taking a closer look at him, the head sculpt has some great paint applications. You got green right there in the crest, those evil red eyes, a silver mouth plate. Moving on down here to the chest, he's got a tampographed crack right there on his right window. And I do like the windows. They are translucent plastic with a green background, so that looks really good. There's a tampographed silver Autobot logo or silver outlined Autobot logo right there on the right shoulder. Moving on down to the stomach area, we have more silver and gray. Down here on the waist, we got more of that lime green collar and navy right there on the crotch. Down here on the legs, we've got silver shins, and that's about it. I do like the silver there inside the wheels. So all in all, a really cool looking Optimus Prime, and I can't wait to see what Toy Hacks has in store for him. So there you go, guys. One final look at Shattered Glass Optimus Prime before and after. Shattered Glass Optimus Prime gets quite a few new decals to help enhance his robot mode. Taking a closer look at the figure, he gets new decals right here on top of the head. Blue accent decals, but this one on this side has a red stripe that lines up to the red stripe there on his brand new chrome faceplate. He also gets new red chrome eyes. You do have a couple different options. You can go with red or green, but I went with red. I like my evil robots with evil red eyes. Now he also gets new decals that cover up those translucent windows and I'm still kind of on the fence with these. There is the cracked damage here on this one, some little cracks on this window, and these decals look to be more of a armored window. So I I'm not too sure on these. These may come off and I may stick with the regular retail release windows. Down here on the abs, he gets new chrome decals that really pop in the light. New decals right here on the waist and a brand new decal right here for what I like to call the belt buckle. Moving on down for the thighs, we got new decals here and here. Down on the knees, we get new blue and red decals and red and yellow decals here on the feet. As far as the arms are concerned, we get new blue and black decals right there below the bicep and green decals right here above the wrist. Now, Optimus Prime also has some hidden weapons. Flip the panels here, open on the knees, and there is hidden rocket pods. This one I have a hard time lifting up, but there you go. So you got rocket pods in the knees right here. If we flip this down and fold in the fist, we got a rocket pod hid within the forearm. So you've got a rocket pod right there and additional missiles 
here below. So I like that. And then here on the right arm, we flip this panel open, fold in the fist, and we have some sort of energy weapon. We've got the barrel of the weapon here, and there's some kind of green energy right there. So this guy is loaded for bear with weaponry. Also, on Optimus's left arm, there is a readout screen. So it's something he can look at if he's wanting to call his fellow evil Autobots. So there you go, guys. There is Shattered Glass Optimus Prime in robot mode after. In vehicle mode, straight out of the packaging, Shattered Glass Optimus Prime still looks amazing. Taking a closer look at the figure, I absolutely love the front of this cab. It looks so cool with the translucent windows, the green background, and the crack right there. He's got silver striping that goes all the way around the cab. Big grill right there, translucent headlights, big bumper. Here on the side, he's got the Tampagraft Autobot logo once again, and translucent side windows there on both sides. He's got the great looking wheels. I love the wheels on this Earthrise Optimus Prime mold. He's got a darker gray gas, gas tank right there. And that is pretty much it for Shattered Glass Optimus Prime in vehicle mode. So there's one final look at vehicle mode before and after. And the first decals I have to show off are the new decals here for the grill. He now has chrome decals with blood splatter. And there's even a handprint right there. So he has plowed into somebody and just kept rolling. I love that. That is so cool. He also has the window decals that we saw in robot mode and new window decals here on the side to make these look a lot longer. Remember before, it was just the window the translucent window right there. So now this extra decal makes the windows look just a little bigger. More decals here on the front. He gets new headlight decals. Decals right here on the bottom of the bumper. This chrome M, a chrome decal right here, and a license plate that says Prime. Now there are options. You have All Gone instead of till All or One. We got All Gone. And I swear that says car. So maybe that's a Knight Rider reference. If so, that is awesome. On the back of the vehicle, the only decals he has is these rear taillight decals. But still, this looks so cool. I love the chrome blood splattered grill. That is awesome. So there you go, guys. Shattered Glass Optimus Prime in vehicle mode after. Toy Hacks once again makes a fantastic decal set for the Earthrise Optimus Prime mold. This is actually my third one. I've got the regular Earthrise Prime, the alternate universe dead Optimus Prime, and now Shattered Glass Optimus Prime. And I just love what they do for these figures, especially the chrome mouth plate, the hidden weaponry, the chrome abs, and for this guy specifically, in vehicle mode, I love the bloodstained grill. It is so cool looking. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to click that bell icon to get notified when I upload new reviews, including the Toy Hacks decal set for Shattered Glass Ratchet. Once again, guys, this is Patriot Prime, signing out. Hoo-ah!